for the, the next episode, let's look at making advanced raw adjustments. So this is using the third raw file and making some advanced adjustments. So we need to file and open to load the advanced adjustments. Image, advanced adjustments, that's up in the cloud, so that'll download momentarily. That just takes a moment, I could have had that in place. And there it is, it's coming up now, importing it. Now, it says in the instructions to select the Tones panel. Lens, Details, Tones, the Stone Tones Studio. Tones panel, Tones Studio, same thing. Now that's the square with the three dots in it. And there we go. Select the Tones panel, check curves to display a graph. So that's there, up the top. That's turned on. Click on the lower quarter of the line to add a control node, then drag this node down to produce a dip in the graph line. This will deepen the image's tones. Now, let's select this on that line. Drag that down that line. Mm, to about there. That, you can see it's deepening the tones. Let's go up and down. Up, down, up, down. Let's put it about there, shall we? I'd say that's about, uh, that's not too bad. It's not quite as dark as I would really like it. This will deepen the image's tones, okay? Select the details panel. The detail studio, which is just there. Select the detail studio and drag the radius slider to 30%. There we go, 22, 28, 29, 30, uh, 30%. There's the radius slider. Okay, it's going to put that button up. Let's go 30%. Okay, the radius slider to 30% and the amount slider to 60%. There we go, that's 60%. And that adds a small amount of fine detail sharpening. There's the photo, a lot better than it was. And as before, down here, you click develop and that puts that in place. Click develop and it, you saw it then very quickly. It's just developed the image. Now, you'll notice up the top here that the raw words are gone. It was a raw file, it's now not saying that. Select the camera there. And it doesn't say anything about there, about it being a raw image. As usual, we can go back there, advanced adjustment, RGB, and you can save it or do what you like with it. Now, I don't want to save it because I may well use it again. Now, if I've used it again, if I want to use it again, I don't want all that work in there. So if I don't save it, it won't save that work. And that's the end of that little episode. That's the end of page 91.